The sit-in movement was a nonviolent movement of the U.S. civil rights era. Although the first lunch counter sit-in began with just four participants, the attention paid to the protest created a movement that spread across the South in 1960 and 1961. Tonight was absolutely phenomenal. It was so incredible to have members of the 1960 class of Howard High School here. to see this performance as our current students did a reenactment of their sit-in on February the 19th, 1960 at Woolworth. Wasn't no month, month long planning. And most of the people went down there, they were afraid. And you didn't know exactly what gonna happen, as I said before, our parents told us do not get involved. We had about 10 rules to go by, you know, no violence, no fighting, and we pretty much abided by all those rules. Rule number six, no loud talking. When you did it, how did you feel? Well, you know, like I told you earlier, they were all afraid, hoping when nothing happened. You know, then there's a few incidents happened thereafter, but nobody got killed. They were overjoyed to see the smiles on their faces, to understand and to know that these students now know who they are. This has made me feel better about what I've done to see them come out here and support us, knowing that we are actually letting people remember and knowing that what they did, because like I said, I never knew that they did this until, what, about a month ago? I mean, this is living history for Chattanooga and for Howard High School, so nothing uh, could be better. No textbook, no video, no movie could take the place of what these students experienced tonight uh, by having that class here.